Bangladesh flowers. Uh, so today, uh, giving you some updates about Challenge EOS is Chase Eskim here. And uh, today I'm gonna title the, the video Bangladesh flowers because uh, over the last, what is it, uh, 24 hours or so, we, uh, in the last 24 hours, as far as network activity with the Challenge EOS app, we've had uh, six active users in the last 24 hours and we've had five public challenges made. Uh, so five public challenges that anybody has been able to, or anyone is uh, is uh, able to complete if they wish. Uh, they just have to do the challenge requirements, uh, which all, you know, sometimes aren't all that easy. So cool, uh, looks like we got some extra, uh, some increased activity in the network uh, up by 100% uh, according to DAP radar. Uh, so six active users. So uh, definitely, definitely cool to see. And uh, I'll put the, uh, the accounts uh, who made public challenges up here. And we, uh, we sent over 35,000 CHL to each one of those accounts. So each one of those challenge EOS accounts, uh, they got sent 35,000 uh, EOS, or excuse me, 35,000 CHL. And uh, they, uh, they can do whatever they want with those tokens. They're, 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 they're tokens that they can uh, do whatever they wish with. And uh, and if you were to sell those on Nudex right now, uh, the going price for thirty five thousand CHL would be about half an EOS, which uh, at the time of recording this right now would be about one thirty eight. So you know, and that's what the price is right now. You know, who knows where the price will be a year from now, two years from now. You know, no one really knows for sure, but you know that's where it's at right now, as everything stands in the uh, in the Challenge US community, and with uh, six active users in the last 24 hours. So cool. And uh, here's here you know here are a couple of the challenges that we'll take a look at. You know, people made some cool challenge uh, challenges to go see some flowers, and uh, in uh, in in Bangladesh. So I've never been to Bangladesh before. I, I'm sure it's a probably a really cool area, but uh, a little bit far from me. I'm I'm over in California, so uh, I don't I wasn't able to make those to uh, make it over there to complete those challenges. But you know, if I was a little bit closer, I probably would have. And uh, the flowers looked cool and all, but the prize for completing the challenge for uh, was like one or two uh, challenge tokens. So you know one or two challenge tokens, you know, it's pretty cool, pretty cool reward to get, but, uh, you know, I wasn't able to make it all the way out to Bangladesh for that. But, um, and remember, when you download a challenge EOS and you create a challenge, all a challenge is very simple. It's a recorded place, a set place, uh, a set deadline, and a set crypto reward. And all that information gets entered into the blockchain and then it is there for, uh, you know, then it is, 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 gets published on the EOS blockchain is the blockchain we use. And it's the, the one of the, it's the fastest blockchain in the world, you know, for, as far as size and usability, uh, you know, it's, it's very quick and it's very reliable. Uh, so that's why we use the EOS blockchain. Um, very quick, it, you know, an application like ours would have a hard time running on a whole lot of other blockchains. So all that, information gets published to the blockchain remember a place a uh, time a deadline and a cryptographic reward and once that's entered into the blockchain uh, someone else using the challenge EOS app can collect on that challenge if they meet the requirements if they're at the right place at the right time then they can get the reward and you can add some other stuff like you know a picture a description you can add that to your challenge, challenge too, but the gist of it is those three three things. And in order to, and if you fulfill those three things, then the tokens get unlocked and deposited into your challenge EOS account. So, and when you have a challenge EOS account, you can create these challenges or you can complete them. Complete or uh, create. Totally up to you and anybody can create them or complete them. So, really easy to do and you know the reason that we use uh the reason that makes this application or challenge us different and why we use a blockchain 
opposed to like a traditional system is uh, for legitimacy of the challenge, for transparency, for immutability. You know, we could simply have made this uh, a centralized app that, uh, you know, we stored all this, uh, all the challenge criteria on our centralized servers. But if we were to do that, then we'd always have the power to be able to uh, maybe censor certain challenges, to reverse challenges, maybe, maybe you know, somebody that we know, hey, man, I didn't really want to make this challenge. I put up a lot of crypto. I don't want to lose it. Can you reverse this for this uh, tr uh, challenge for, for us? Sorry, we can't. You know, the way it works right now is as soon as the challenge gets published to the blockchain, it's on the blockchain and there's no reversing it. And if someone completes it, they complete it. If someone doesn't complete it, they don't. But we don't have, we can't get involved, we, you know, with the Challenge US application. All, all this application is, is just a way for people to, uh, you know, publish something to the blockchain and then collect uh, a reward from the blockchain and uh, in an easy way. That's the biggest thing that we're going for. We make it free for people to download Challenge EOS. Doesn't cost you any money. And in fact, we give you some of our CHL tokens. So, and then you don't have to pay for any RAM, any CPU. We take care of all that for you. And then you have pretty much an active account on the EOS blockchain that you can use. So let's say if you win a big reward, you know, somebody puts up a, you know, a bunch of uh, tokens for you to go somewhere and you complete the challenge and those tokens get sent to your account or get unlocked to your account, you can move them to some other uh, exchange, you can move them to a different wallet, you have total control over those tokens. So uh, get out there, start making challenges. And for the people that make challenges, you know, we want to uh, reward you guys. Like I said, we reward all those accounts that I mentioned uh, that, uh, that made challenges in the last 24 hours. And we, uh, you know, we're going to continue to uh, make these challenges. And uh, we got uh, today was the last day of the, the video, the video reward, and uh, we had a, a one-week competition for a video reward, and uh, we're gonna have the we're gonna announce the winner of that uh, shortly. So uh, so stay tuned, guys, and a lot more uh, updates to come.